reward, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Jacked up and good to go. The entertainment title in the following video is rated M for mature. You have been duly warned. This video is not for children or the faint of heart. Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Fulcrum, and welcome back to Bioshock Infinite. Now we just got our latest infusion. I'm a little lost, like normal. I have a tendency to put uh, a lot of bullets through people. Yeah, well, now you look like you're at your shop. You want to hold on to this? I said you found a lockpick. Where? Oh, that's sneaky. Okay. There we go, we got our shock boost. Let's see what else we're gonna play with. And I really don't use a lot of different weapons. I could just, you know, face first into a wall. Okay. Well, my curiosity has been sated. Let's move. Game, please don't do this. I am scared of you crashing. Not already still for me, okay. Respect you. Also, this is just kind of terrifying. Oof! <laughs> okay! I get it. Don't be exploratory. Have to itch. Where are you going? Come on. What are we looking for? There it is. That could be something really bad if we're not careful. Um... Is 
swear to God, more one grave says than Tesco. Those are those are the exact same. Do it. Okay. It's your mother's grave. They have her preserved in an airtight chamber. Her fingerprints will get us into Comstock House. She's yeah. your mother. mother who abandons their child doesn't draw a lot of sympathy in my book. Take a moment to think about what you're doing. There. Will you open the door or do I have to go in without you? Well, I'll go in with you, but desecrating a corpse has very significant consequences. Elizabeth. It's her. How are you, mother? All locked up in there, huh? Looks like you and I have some common ground. Let me do it. No. Let me do it. Aww. You see, child, you chose to follow a false shepherd, and he has led you astray. <laughs> what I do, I do for love. What lion does not so, remember those uh, consequences I was talking about? Rest for a minute. No, I'm getting that hand. Elizabeth, why is your mother a ghost? She's not. He he used me to, to power that device. He opened up some kind of tear. Oh boy. Your mother oh, wrong button. is raising the dead. Thank you. Why? Oh god. Oh god. I don't know. What am I? My god. Is she the source of my power? But what is she? Alive or dead? Why do you ask me? When the delicious question is when. The only difference between past and present is semantics. Lives, lived, will live. Dies, died, will die. If we could perceive time as it truly was. What reason would grammar professors have to get out of bed? Like us all, Lady Comstock exists across time. She's both alive and dead. She perceives me both. She finds this condition disagreeable. Perception without comprehension. It's a dangerous combination. Look! Footsteps. She goes to unfinished business. We have to follow her. Convince her to open the gate to constant house. It's a shame you have need of her to enter Comstock House. Frankly, she doesn't seem all that cooperative. There is a way to bring her to reason. Three truths you must discover first. Truths which, in this world, Comstock has destroyed. If only one of you had the power to alter time and space. That would be a blessing, wouldn't it? Mm. Well, they're sarcastic. I mean, they're not wrong. There's something off about Lady Comstock. Yeah. I noticed. No, you don't understand. She... she doesn't... 
belong here. I brought something through, but I'm just I'm so sure it was her. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Freight hook. Freight hook. Done. Tesla coils. All right. As a what did you mean some... before when you said Lady Comstock didn't belong here? She's almost feral. It's like she's a reflection. Um, I don't know. A few? Comstock seems to have been made sterile by simple exposure to our contraption. A theory. Just as sexual reproduction can de-emphasize the traits of each parent, so goes the effect of multiple realities on our own. Your traits dissipate until they become unrecognizable or cease to exist. Okay, that engenders a lot of questions. But... <clears throat> nice. Okay, Elizabeth. I know it's a lot to take in, but... Stuck. Yeah, I was right. Financial district. Of course. <coughs> Fan does bleed. Think you can crack this one open? Give me a second. Done.
You! Hey, you wanna do this? Fine. Yeah, that's how it feels. Or me getting stuck on a chair. <sighs> Sorry, I'm not here to make a, a withdrawal. Uh, Yeah, I'm trying to find where it's the door, but... Alright, here we go. Up we go. <clears throat> Profits Bank looting the city like gold calf. What's he charge for a pair of wings? timing. Damn straight. <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, God. Yeah, girl. Give me some time. Thank you. Catch. That'll do. Yeah, no. I'm willing to be very patient. Yeah, there's a lot of money here. Locked. Elizabeth. Keep a lookout. Yeah, no problem. Done. What we got? Shotgun. Fifty percent. What's that? Fifty percent of everything people earn here goes right to Comstock as a tithe. I gotta get me a job in the profit business. You hold on to this. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I gotta get me a job in the profit business. Here, hold this. <laughs> So let's go this way.
Dude died with an entire pineapple. That's a hell of a way to go. What we got here? I like my current build. Well, you know, time like the present. Footsteps seem to go down to the vault. Well. I'm not gonna go that way. I am gonna go that way. It's gonna be time to. Aspirants. All right. These guys certainly do. Let's take a quick boo through. Here's some cash. Oh, thank you. Shark jockey on, right? Yep. Hmm. Okay, I didn't even get to see what that said because I accidentally flipped through too quick. Funny thing is that people use any sort of cause to be able to s to loot. It's this kind of a fact of riots and revolutions is that of herself and my feelings towards her. What do you mean? I'm just so angry at her and uh, her father. I 
think she's her, but she's also awesome. her. Where'd you go? Well, if I ever find a machine, I am going to be loaded for bear. Speak of the devil, and he shall appear. Grab that. Yeah, shark jockey really helps. There we go. <laughs> I think we're done here. My god. Okay, up we go. Alright. Let's do this. Who you gonna call? It's Booker! <laughs> There's that loading. You have more of an idea than I do, Will Smith. So you not telling me? <clears throat> There's something you're not telling me. Okay.
Watch out, Black Cannon! Come on. Go check this. Let's see if there's anything more. I thought it was just get all the carbine. The seat, the seat keep popping up, so. Putting those lock picking skills to work. Give me a second. Got it. Not open that just yet. Cause. Hello! That's... I saw shiny. I have so many lockpicks and I don't know what to do with them. But you two are dead. I took your funeral photo. Yes, and made an absolute hash of it. One doesn't expect to one's cause. It's come across so lifelessly. Huh. And there we go. I took most of my money, but it was worth it. What's this? Can you open this, Elizabeth? Really? That little old lock. Ready. Huh. There you come, stuck. A lot of bullet. In front of all the men, the sergeant looked at me and said, Your family tree shelters a TP or two, doesn't it, son? This lie! This calumny had followed me all my life. Is that Tell day no Lady Comstock. Or Tessus. And anyone who knew the truth was better dead than alive. I'm not even his daughter. I'm just some specimen. I mean, yeah. No, you are not. Elizabeth, listen to me. We have to think through. Ain't nobody in the world deserves that. <laughs> we are getting out of here. You got it? You're never gonna have to look back. Anyways. Thank you all so much for joining me. Have a fantastic one. I've been Mr. Fulcrum. As always, have fun. Leave sadness behind you. No matter where you go, there you are. See you next time.